Souls RNG Era 8 brought many achievements players haven't seen. So today, we'll be showing you how to get all the new Souls RNG achievements so you can flex it to your friends. We'll also be doing a 5 Souls RNG Game Pass giveaway because chat, I can't lie, only 1% of you guys are subscribed. So to do this giveaway, you have to watch this video to the end and of course subscribe. After that, comment on your Roblox username. And with that being said, let's get right into the video. The first badge is the stigma. I'll put it up on screen as you can see one of the more unique ones and to get this you have to be in a server with someone using the red full moon aura and that is usually the developer. I'll show you how the aura looks like just so you can make sure if you ever find it that you can get the badge. With that being said let's move on to the next one. The next achievement which is probably the most mysterious is the unknown achievement and to get this you have to get the new oblivion aura which no one has rolled yet by the way so if you guys roll it well I'm not gonna lie you're gonna be really famous and to get this of course you need a void potion and when you get that void potion you pop it into one in two thousand chance now getting this is super hard and that's why no one has gotten yet and i believe 53 actually did say that getting this aura is actually not going to happen within the first two weeks so there is that so just save up your coins get those void coins and void potions right with that being said let's move on to the next aura now for the next two achievements they both kind of build off each other the first one is there is no way i'll put up on the screen and to get this title all you need to do is get a one million plus aura which is actually very hard i can't lie so abyssal hunters symphony all those auras to roll it and you'll get this really nice cool badge and secondly you have my first one billion plus finding now to get this you need to roll a one billion plus aura. now this is really interesting because up to my belief there are no one billion plus or so correct me if i'm wrong with that being said let's move on to the next achievements the next achievement is called eternal time and the description is pretty funny it's your your PC is overloaded and to get this you need to play the game for 2,000 hours which is by the way Chad that's almost three months of playing Souls RNG so hey <laughs> that's crazy right and the reward is two heavenly potions which is not enough for burning my PC I mean they literally said it yourself your PC is overloaded right regardless again to do this all you gotta do is if can game pretty hard pretty hard on your electric bill actually not on you right <laughs> the next few achievements are all in one group but I will talk about them briefly because these are are very important to your soul's RNG progression and these are break the blank here achievement skill tree now oh, why did I use the word skill tree regardless the point of these are depending on the amount of biome exclusive breakthroughs you will get those are gonna give certain items for example getting 100 biome exclusive ores without native rarity now let me give you an example of this for example if you get an abyssal hunter outside of the rainy biome that will count one counter of this 100 biome exclusive aura without native rarity the word native rarity basically means that if it's breakthrough then it's without native rarity right with that being said break the space you need to get 100 breakthroughs right and the reward is actually really good so runa corruptions runa hell runa galaxy i explained what all these runes do in one of my videos but basically it's as if you're in that biome without actually having it, right so it's a consumable right however the most important of these is so break the galaxy which gives 1000 bomb exclusive auras right and then lastly break the reality now break the reality is arguably one of the best achievements well first of all you need to get a breakthrough 10,000 times so that is pretty hard however the reward is a rune of everything now this is as if you're in every single biome in the game except for glitch so the rune of everything is everything except for the glitch biome so be sure to keep this in mind while you're popping a heavenly potion because this is super overpowered all right and the last two or three achievements all have to do with the aura so the first one is called flaws in the world now this is for both achievements right and the first one badge looks like this and this is from getting the glitch aura and the second one is flaws in the world again except the titles a bit different sorry the badge is a bit different and this is getting one in 220 million from oppression right and lastly we have spotted the soul the most rarest title you can have and very few people have it and this description reads i saw something that i shouldn't have seen right and now to get this you need to be in a server with someone using soul and most of the time this is a developer because if you guys remember you can't equip the soul aura if you are a player for longer than when the developer is in the server so if you have the aura i believe when you leave you won't have anymore so there's that anyways chat that's all for today's video keep in mind that there is is still a giveaway so be sure to subscribe for that anyways i'll see you all later stay safe and peace